friends welcome back to perfectly imperfect gardening with me Tanya today I get to bring you guys mango Delta hot pepper sauce with ginger I'm gonna add ginger to mine cuz got so many good benefits to it so let's get this going guys, I'm making this pepper this sauce outside because the hot peppers can get real strong in the house I have my little stand that I made that I have set up for it I have my little grill I have my pot have the blender and I have the ingredients I have my mangoes I have the ginger I have a uh, um, chili pepper green chili I have a red bell pepper I have an onion I have some garlic cloves right here and some salt and pepper and down here I have some white vinegar some white vinegar and the salt and pepper to its taste so we're gonna get going first I'm gonna cut these up into pieces so that I can get them going so I'm gonna start the grill get everything hot get everything into the sizes that I need them to grill and we'll get going with the cooking process forgot to mention I have some chicken here that's not seasoned I washed it but I haven't seasoned it yet I'm gonna start that to grilling while I um, saute the sauce the way I can have something to try it on The ginger. Oh, that smells so good. It's easier to use a spoon. Get a spoon and just scrape it off like that. Now I got to get the Delta Peppers. Guys, while I'm getting that done, I have to pick some Delta Peppers. I'm 
from this lovely data tree. Off of here. Good little bee. Let me pick all these peppers. quite how many I'm gonna need. That's the first time I ever did this. But I have a lot. I'm gonna put some of the sugar rush cream peppers in it too. Pick some of these sweet babies. Get back over. Okay guys, what I'm doing is just popping off the top of the stem. I love the seed because I love it hot. So I'm keeping on the top of the seed. And we're gonna cut these in half. Make sure you wash everything super good. Out of this kitchen, there is no way. But I came inside to wash off the peppers and stuff. Now I can get to work. What I did was I took off the stem washed them took off the stem put these in whole put these ones in half these are the sugar rush cream peppers and on the bottom of this grill right here it has these trays they will cook them under here like so put this one on this side over here has a slot for like eight of those. The flies want to be out today. This chicken, y'all, finna season it up. I'm gonna use this Maggie and some salt and pepper right here. To seasoning up this chicken. Let me switch hands. Just put enough in there, then I shake, mix my chicken around. chicken. Don't want too much seasoning because I want to be able to taste the sauce. Sit this under here until ready. garlic here for my sauce. I'm going to use six of them. Don't add them too soon because the garlic burns. If they burn, it'll be better. So, three, four, five, six. And let them roast. Under here. 
I got my my green chilies going, my red bell pepper going, got some onions going here, mango here, mango going here. I have my delta peppers going under here. Got the garlic going over here. And I have the sugar rush cream peppers going under here. Grilling quite nicely. It's like a fire. See, right there, under there. That's roasting those peppers. And I have this up here grilling. Grill these peppers. Get back here, JT. As soon as it char a little bit, we'll be back to turn them and get to the next step. Letting this pot heat up while this finish out. Oh, it smells so good. Everything to here as we start to assemble. Sizzle. Oh, and I put end up putting jalapeno pieces. Pieces on here too. Mango. Make sure I don't. I hope I throw away that seed. Nope, that's the seed right here. Get all that good. Let's see if I can get the top off. Then after that, you're gonna let it saute for like 20 minutes.
just pour enough to cover your top. Just like so. Add salt to taste. Pepper. And a lemon. So citrus. Let me cut that up. Put a half to a whole lemon. I love citrus, so. Let that simmer for 20 minutes. Got this chicken going up here, y'all. And the sauce is cooking. Good so far. Now let's just let that cook. Y'all, it's been about 10 minutes. You gotta get these pieces to get soft. Super soft. And plus we rendering the, the vinegar to get it. So it won't be so potent. Getting all these flavors mixed in together. The red chili, the bell peppers, the the daughter, the data peppers, that garlic and that ginger, them onions, all that mixed in there together. About 15 more minutes. Should be nice and soft. I took the chicken off and put it in the oven in the house. Let me go check on it. All these flies. I hate flies. <clears throat> they have a top, so we good with it. But this chicken didn't have a top. So. Okay guys, now it seems like they're soft enough. Now all I have to do is blend it. Okay, this is nice and done. Should be nice and soft.
Yeah, we had school this day. Ooh! Y'all seen that? Let it cool down first. <laughs> Let it cool down first. Let me go wash this stuff. Be right back. Y'all seen that pop, right? <laughs> Make sure you let it cool down. Make sure I get up no chunks. <clears throat> you can make it as thin or as thick as you like. Make sure y'all get a funnel too. finished y'all thank you so much for staying to the end of this video <sighs> I'm gonna do a little clip of me trying it and um, with my chicken and then you guys could go right after you see me try it this wonderful delicious hot sauce Delta hot sauce it's gonna rain that's why I'm rushing it See that sky? Yes. It's bad out here. Hear that thunder? And lightning. Mm-hmm. But I got done just in time for this delicious hot sauce. Ooh, I'm still sweat. Sun went in, I'm still sweat. But Let's get this tasted. Cause I can't wait. Let's get this chicken out of here. Yeah. I was gonna use this pot under here, put it in there first, but the handle is plastic. So I got this chicken out. Made me a plate. Made it in just in time. Left my water bottle. Oh, and my water bottle wanna fall. Dang it, gotta go in this rain. Dang it, dang it, dang it. I cut a bigger hole on here so I can try this sauce. Let me flip. Ooh, I got in here in time. It is storming out that door. Storming. Let me try this. It's good, but I use a little less citrus next time. I think I put too many, too much lemon. Yeah, I think I put a little bit too much lemon in it. But other than that, it tastes really good. So, put on like a half a lemon in y'all. I, I use the whole lemon. I use like a half a lemon. Other than that, everything was delicious. 
So I hope you try this recipe. And I'm going to see you later.